A big milestone for the Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory today. Don Ford shows us their new supercomputer. Behind me in this relatively ordinary looking building is one of the fastest, largest artificial intelligence computers in the world. And today the Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory is giving us a television exclusive look. It's called Sierra, a very different kind of supercomputer than ever before. While massive with 7,000 square feet of floor space, 240 racks, it's actually the unique design architecture configured specifically to run artificial intelligence that is the breakthrough. We've been talking about artificial intelligence for decades. Mm -hmm. Started in the science fiction realm and has grown into reality. It has 8,640 IBM Power 9 CPUs, coupled with, get this, 17,280 NVIDIA V100 graphics processing units, the same company that produces professional video gaming cards. Combined, these custom designed chips and the classified software are creating detailed computer simulations to a level never seen before. And it's not just for studying nuclear reactions. They can study biology all the way down to the individual atoms, the hydrogens, the atomic levels, down, all the way down there. Cancer, HIV, traumatic brain injuries are just a few topics that scientists are eager to get started on. With the computer, we'll be able to do much faster testing of this, much lower, uh, much lower risk testing, because we'll be able to do a lot of it in the computer. Instead and, of on a human. Instead of on a human. And like all good computer systems, Sierra has a backup. At the Oak Ridge National Laboratory in Tennessee, there is an identical system called Summit. In Livermore, Don Ford, KPIX5.